What is that? Jack? Merry Christmas to Chew. Hey, Purple Cliff, this is Santa Claus? Just kidding, it's your editors. We laced this card with sleep, sleep powder. <coughs> and we bought the most cursed Pokemon presents we could find. My editors stole my credit card again. Where do I even start? We're going with this. Oh my God, the wrapping is terrible. Who wrapped these? Ho, ho, ho. That's what I said to Purple Clip's mom last night. <laughs> Santa's in a good mood. I just ate a master level Herba Mystica sandwich and bodied three shinies, so I'm feeling a little generous. This guy's been fighting packages every time he opens one, so I think it's time we cut him a little slack. Literally. It's a piece of metal? They got me a piece of aluminum, but it's a Pokemon card knife. I might be able to use this to open up packages. Where's one? Give me. They've bought me some terrible Pokemon stuff in the past. These can't be that bad. All right, let me just take my knife. It works better than half the other things we've used in these videos. I just got my Santa outfit in the mail. I'm so excited. I'm gonna put it on right now. What the f is this? No! So what if the rock meets Jigglypuff? We've got another 3D printed rock. Why? They keep sending me 3D printed stuff and I'm gonna keep putting it in this weird cubby. It's staring at me. I feel like every time I look over it, the vine boom sound's gonna play. Next package. Wait, where's my knife? Let's open this one. Who needs a real knife when I've got my trusty card? Jack never answers his phone as you can see. So I got him a new one. Please don't be ugly. What is it? Huh? A Pikachu telephone? It's in a Ziploc bag, and honestly, it's kind of crusty. I feel like if I open this thing, some sort of vengeful spirit's gonna be released. I put batteries in it and it still doesn't work. What am I supposed to do? Rub it in. <gasps> Reggie from Nintendo. What am I supposed to do with this? It's going back there. They hid that one under the tree. I bet you I was supposed to open this last. Oh, it's something squishy, I think. Surprisingly, Jack treats us well, even though I'm just in. Yeah. So, we're gonna get him something nice. F slash S. F slash S. Fun size? I truly have no words for this one. I like it. Now, I want this for myself, so I'm just gonna order it to his house and then steal it. Oh, wait. This is from Japan. That means it could either be really cool or really dumb. Oh my god. What? I've got this little Leafeon thing. I don't know what this is, but it's like a little rice guy and it's cool. And then, this is a fluffy... Snorlox bag. That's, this is the coolest one out of all of them. This is so cool. I will actually use these. That's probably the only nice present out of all of these. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. The tiny ones scare me, man, because it might just be a, a, another knife card. Jack needs more ornaments to decorate his tree, so I'm thinking we go with the all-time classic, surprise Pika. Wood? A wooden Pikachu ornament we're putting this on the tree right now <laughs> i'm gonna put it right in the middle is putting a tree on a tree evil next box i'm going off the top another small one merry christmas everybody huh i can't say that happy holidays from your favorite little elf i'm not even little dude he got him some pretty wacky and zany products but i don't think we've ever gotten him some drip or i could just get him this button bro <laughs> oh how am i gonna get this open where's my knife I should not be doing this. Are they gibbets? Do I put these on my Crocs? Jigglypuff and love. I feel like a human pair of Crocs that people just put gibbets on. Ta-da! Next present, this one. I don't know what it is. I don't care what it is. Jack's tree is looking a little empty. I think this is gonna help. A box. Is this one fragile? Oh yeah, it is. It's a Pikachu ornament. This thing is nice. Look at this thing. Okay, we're putting this on the tree. Let's put this one right here. That looks pretty good. I should have got a bigger tree. I bought a 10 foot tree and I'm taller than it. So I'm gonna open up the biggest box. It's very light. Where's my card? What's a little tape? Ah! We all know Jack loves shinies. So I thought I'd buy some for him. What is even that? Is this a Pikachu nightlight? Hold on. You might be saying, wow, Jack, this is the coolest night lamp ever for Pokemon. What are these? A white Articuno? That's not even Oddish. Why'd they glue him upside down? It's like 
They got a nice lampshade and then glued a bunch of bootleg little plastic figures to the bottom. Are these even like... The Articuno fell off. Who packaged this? From Burrito Princess. I've seen this man's decorating abilities. I'm Santa, I see everything, everything. So we gotta step his tree game up a little bit. Let's look for some ornaments. Ooh, I like these. Elves, fire it up. Yes, sir, yes! It goes on forever, oh my. It's a Baneri ornament wearing a Santa Claus hat? Oh, I didn't realize how many ornaments. I'm gonna have the most stacked Christmas tree of all time. Another Santa Claus one. This is the most prepared I've ever been for boxes. I'm a Christmas tree. Oh, damn, a custom chug jug? Jack's 14, he'll love this. Is this a cup? Is it a candle? It's a chug jug. Imagine going to the function and you're, you're rocking this thing. <laughs> Up. Hey there. I'm giving the chug jug to the pink dinosaur. This one isn't even wrapped. Let's get Jack something personal, something just for him. This is perfect. What should we put on it? Let's let Olaf decide. What is it? They got me a keychain that just says stupid. Imagine you get the order in that's just like, yeah, give me a keychain that has stupid in green, a heart in red, and then a fucking Pikachu. Ta-da! Big boxes are working well. There are so many packages. How much of my money did they spend? This is an Amazon box. Well, this is the sh Come on, it was a good joke! Oh, oh God, what is this? I can't show you, but it's a Pikachu in a toilet. And the toilet is not clean. It has an on button? <laughs> ah! Who sells that? I want a non-big box. We're getting whatever this tiny little thing is. If there's one thing about Purple Cliff that I know is that he is a huge mobile gamer. But his phone, it, it doesn't have a pop socket. It's got nothing on it. How can he get maximized grippage on a phone that's not maximized for grippage? Mm. Perfect. You've got great taste. Oh, do do not bend. <laughs> What's this? It's a ditto something? <gasps> Is this a pop socket? Oh my God. <laughs> it's a ditto pop socket. This is so cool. This is like... Maximized grippage. Don't be broken, don't be broken, don't be broken. Bro, and it makes phones indestructible? Big box. I'm gonna need the knife. It says this side up. I feel like I was a little too harsh with the representative of the art of taxidermy that I chose for Jack last time. <laughs> so this time, <laughs> let's get him something nice. It's got a letter. Thank you so much for your order. They put up a Starmie Pokemon card. Why did they give me a Starmie? What did they buy? Oh wait, this is cool. They gave me a Starmie card because the gift is a purple starfish made to look like Starmie. Where am I putting this? Starmie is right there. I, it needs friends. Okay. Oh wait, this isn't for my editor. Haha. -ha. The knife flew out the window. Ugh, this is a big box, but it's really light. Happy holidays, Plurple Cliff. I made you a friend. Don't forget to give her belly a squeeze. And it's covered in Minecraft stickers from Boots. This is from Boots? <laughs> oh, this is cool. Is this a handmade Chad? What happens if you press the stomach? I'm over here stroking my dick. I got lotion. This is what we're putting next to the star me. The two best works of art. Apparently there's a video of the creation of that thing. So we'll put it, we'll put it in the description. I can't make a decision. Which one am I opening? That one? Okay. This isn't Pikachu. This is an abomination made to hunt you and your children down in the post-apocalyptic world ruled by Nintendo. Hold on. There's a video. Oh God. He's already loose. This looks like it's from someone's grandma. Janie's mill. Like a milf? Is this Janie's mom? Ah, got it. Go Pikachu, go! Come on, bro, you got this! Yeah, nope, that's, that's cursed. That's weird. It's going back here too. This one's squishy. I have a good feeling. One thing we have to work on next year is Jack's fashion sense. But don't worry, I'm here to help. Now, Jack loves the Jigglypuff family line. Oh, holy moly!
on. So we're gonna get him an embroidered crew neck. Blue? Wait a minute. This is so cute. I would wear this. Yeet. Kobe. That went in. Another squishy one. Jack has the attention span of a four-year-old and he doesn't have anything on brand. So this should do it. From Canada. <gasps> They're Pokemon pop sockets. <laughs> We're opening this. Purple Cliff. There's a note. Oh, is this from the Pokemon Company? Happy holidays, Purple Cliff. Thank you for working with us this past year. Love, TPCI. Aww, that's the first time Pokemon's ever sent me something. Thank you, Pokemon. Now, what'd they send me? Together for the holidays? Are these ornaments? We're opening together. <gasps> oh my God. These are the ornaments they just sent me. We're putting them on the tree right now. We're putting the Pikachu right next to the scuffed one. They're they're making out. Um, ta-da! My tree actually looks much better than it started. Oh, here's a hunt, wait, wait, there's a hundred dollar gift card too? <gasps> I'm buying Pokemon cards. It's squishy. Passes the sniff test. Olaf and I had the same idea. We gotta cover this man's grippers up. Beautiful. Let me guess, let me guess. I'm gonna open this. There's gonna be a bag. Wait, what is this? Plurple Cliff. Are these Pokemon stockings? This one says Plurple Cliff, and this one just says Crimis. We're gonna hang them on the tree too. <laughs> Ta-da! All right. Jack's walls are pretty empty, and he needs some artwork. I'm thinking Picasso, Michelangelo, the Sistine. Well, that doesn't tell me what it is. Where's the knife? Always cut away from yourself. Oh no. Wait, 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 what is this? It's Magic Arm Scream. Okay, in front of the Twitch box. <laughs> I think this might be another artwork. Jack's been really big into neon signs lately, and I definitely know he doesn't have this one. It's a fragile pizza box. A charger? Thank you for supporting my small business. I hope you love your sign. I can't tell what it is behind the bubble wrap. It's just a Pikachu sign. Wait, that's cool. I was afraid it was gonna be some like Pikachu balls. Why what was that the first thing my mind went to? Wait for it. Ta-da! Yo, shout out Twin Cities Blow, Sh Blow Shop. Glow shop. This is the heaviest one yet. Jack has played so much Scarlet and Violet that he kind of starting to smell. This is exactly what he needs. It might be Pokemon cards. This could be flowers. It definitely is not anything weird or dead or taxidermy. Oh, it smells. Soki Doki Bath Company? They're Pokemon bath bombs. These smell so good. This is so these ones are so cool. <laughs> I'm getting a bath after this video. Most of these gifts have actually been really cool. I came into this fully expecting for everything to just be gross, disgusting, weird Pokemon stuff. I think we should get something nice for Jack. You know, something from the heart, something handmade. That is not what I meant. Oh my God, there's so much wrapping. Huh? It's got a Charmander on the inside. Don't worry, where, where's his bottom half? It's right there. And then inside that is Squirtle. And then, and then inside that, Bulbasaur. And then inside Bulbasaur. There's a Mudkip. Oh, thanks guys. I don't know how I would ever live without my Pokemon inside Pokemon inside Pokemon ball. Okay, like real talk though. How are people supposed to have fun with these? Oh darn, I bought this Pikachu, but I really wanted a Charmander. <gasps> Next to the chug jug. We got another small box and it's covered in wrapping. So far I'd say this is the tamest I've ever been. So I think to round it out, we got to dial it up a bit. Oh my God. Whoever did this, put it behind like 8 billion layers of tape. There's tape within tape within tape. Who did this? What is it? The bottom half of a Pikachu? The magnetic Pikachu taking a sh**. What, what am, where am I supposed to put this? On my refrigerator? This feels like it might be a magazine. I wanted to get Jack a book, but I don't know if he can read. Blow shop. So I got him something with a lot of pictures. Do not bend. Codex of Pokemon. A Pokemon illuminated manuscript. Wait a second, God is giving Ash his Pikachu. That's how season one of Pokemon went. Anybody who has not, who's not been alive, that's how it goes. Next box. Who doesn't love Christmas cookies? Me. Me. 
me. Oh, well maybe he doesn't need this Super Snorlax limited edition mega cookie holder for holding cookies for the holidays then. This is light, like light, light and fragile. What is it? It's a Santa Snorlax. That's cute. I've got a really good place to put this. One sec. I've just got to open this up. This one was under it and it's flexible. What, whatever that means. I've been in the lab cooking, thinking of the next big item to get our boy Jack. My neurons activated. My brain has reached a level of intellectuality that I never thought ice pop holders. Why do I get the feeling Jack is gonna put these on his fingers? I don't think these are meant for fingers. Are these like Pikachu tail covers? I'm from One Piece. Ha 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 ha. Don't unsubscribe, please. There's only five gifts left. We're gonna go from smallest to biggest, starting with whatever this is. It is winter now and the holidays are fast approaching. That means it's getting cold outside. We need something to keep Jack's little noggin warm. Now, I don't know about you, but that looks pretty warm to me. Do I open it from this way? Nope. This way, it's another crocheted thing. Is, wait, is this a hat? You guys like my hat? That's what these things were. They're just ear covers. Ta-da! I don't think they're ear covers. I think this is the next smallest one. This is from Slovenia. What, how, what is, how do you, people live in Slovenia? Jack's got a pretty big collection of balls, but none of those balls are polywag balls, and they don't have a button in its little sucker mouth. What is it? I think it's a big polywag. Oh my God. It's a polywag pokeball. This is so cool. That's the real great ball. There haven't been any taxidermied squirrels. I think we're in the clear. What are you? Why would man dare to make you? Let me just open this. All right, what is it? It's, it's another Pikachu. Don't be weird. What? Did this Pikachu survive a war? This is officially the most cursed Pokemon Pikachu of all time. I'm keeping it in the package because I don't want the heebie-jeebies unleashed in my neighborhood, but I'm gonna put them next to the other Pikachu. Three packages left. We're at this box. I lost my glasses. Oh, oh. Oh, this box smells kind of weird, man. I don't have a good feeling about this one. Dude, I, I thought this was so much bigger than it actually. Oh, is that real or is this plastic? Oh my God, I think it's real. I don't know if it's real or not. It's a skull of an animal maybe, or it's fake. I don't know, but I'm not taking any chances because these guys will literally send me dead squirrels. Dude, this is like really cool, but I don't know if it's real or not. I'm gonna put it here so it doesn't have to deal with me. The boxes can't hurt you, Jack. The boxes cannot hurt you. This one's also light, man. I have this goofy looking Pikachu and I want Jack to experience the pure joy that I get from looking at this guy every single day. <sighs> you have a brother. It's the big light boxes that scare me. If this is the brain of that Pikachu thing, I'm gonna be so disappointed. Wait a minute, I think it's a... This is the most bootleg plush I've ever seen in my life. Wait, this is this is actually from Nintendo. You know how like plush animals are squishy? This one's not squishy. We can move it. <laughs> Ditto died. F in the comments for Ditto. There's one final box. Please be something good. Now we need to hit him with something so crazy, so zany, it knocks his cute little Pokemon pajamas right off. Off. We're not only gonna get him this cast form, but we're also getting him the matching Flaffy and my personal favorite, the Jolteon. This is gonna be the best Christmas ever. Oh, this box smells worse than all the other ones, bro. This is like the most serial killer box wrapping I've seen in my life. This thing is like destroyed. One last box. It's still good. Oh, dude, it's plushies. God, we've got a, a cast form. Yay, a, a Silsoon, a Marie. Not even a mother could love this. Oh wait, there's a note. Thank you so much for your purchase. It meant a lot to me and I hope you enjoy it all. I included some free extras, one free plush, four magnets, two stickers. This is my largest order so far. It means the world to me. Oh, you know, I love these plushes. These things are awesome. Oh wait, there's one more thing in the box. It's like a Jolteon. Ah! It's a freaking squirrel again, man. That's a rat, that's a rat. That was a real rat. It's a freaking rat. It's a stuffed rat. It's real. I think it's real. A rat. Thanks for watching this video. Make sure to subscribe and I hope you have a very happy Christmas. Oh, I'm afraid it's gonna move. Ah! Oh, hey.
Uh, I just wanted to come in and thank you guys for watching these videos. Thank you for subscribing, for liking, for being one of the thousand people that puts in a comment. I just wanted to thank you for being a part of the Cliffside. None of these videos would be possible without all of the viewers at home. And I mean, you guys have changed my life. Thank you so much for this year. And I really hope I can continue to keep making people laugh in 2023. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.